for precise calibration of photorobot ARIO, we are using this simple pattern that is provided in PDF file. This is a set of points to which our picture recognition is focused, then later during calibration and helping the robot to find the precise center of rotation. Uh, this is caused by various camera weights uh, that causes different structure bands and we need to get the results as precise as possible. So to get this layout as I have here, it's best way to print it. What's important is to print it one to one. That means no fit to page options at the page. It can be printed on a regular office paper. This is about 80 grams per square meter. We have here 200 grams, which is not so easy to fold, but works better later. Here are indicated lines to be fold first. Uh, I will easily find out the point and make the first bend. So the second at the other side. And as the instruction here indicates, I will glue it here with self-adhesive tape to this pattern. The easiest way is to put it like that in front of you. Have a proper length of the tape, cut it that way. It's easy to stick it on the table as well because the tape always sticks better to the paper than to the tape so it's perfectly uh, straight right now and then I can easily remove it from that point then position the edges precisely and just best way from the center point bend the tape from the other side and from the center. So here we are. Now it's a good time to get a proper shape which is here perpendicular and here in 45 degrees. Uh, here is marked that the center point of this side is 33 millimeters above the level so the robot then will rotate directly opposite this point here in the center. So next step is to identify the height of camera level against the third arm level. Here we have 218 millimeters to the center. Here is indicated 247 millimeters to the center. That means that the distance between the center is 29 millimeters above. For precise calibration, we need to put this pattern into the center of uh, robot's rotation. Here is indicated that 43 millimeters is the center uh, of the center point at the other side. And now we will use the lasers that are indicating the center of rotation. It's good to use a paper that is then later slightly in front of the image so the camera can for identification better find the pattern we are working with and then easily place the pattern into the center of the picture based on those two lines and the center point visually.